Have you ever seen someone chase someone so hard they'll do anything to get them? And when they finally do, it's like something in them switches off. They're not in love. They're addicted to the chase. Like when you pick up your phone, you scroll, refresh, you wait for something, anything new. That tiny rush you feel, that's not joy. That's anticipation. Your brain's releasing dopamine, but the cheap kind. It's not about pleasure. It's about pursuit, the chase, the maybe. It's your brain way of saying, hey, that thing might get you what you want. Go get it. Neuroscientists call it dopamine feedback loop. A cycle of almost every pin, every scroll, every just one more teaches your brain to chase the next hit. And when it gets it, the chemical fades. So you chase again. Real dopamine, the stable kind, comes after effort. The workout, the art, the conversation, the thing that asks something of you. That's the kind that lingers because it's tied to meaning. Now, I'm not here to tell you to quit dopamine, just to upgrade it. Or you know what? Let's be real. Upgrading means letting go of the cheap kind. <laughs> and who's really doing that? So maybe the answer is balance. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. I think that's beautiful.